Behold, the Ohio State University, an institution where traditions are more than just a habit from the past. For example, every year students jump into the frigid waters of Mirror Lake in an attempt to bring favor to the home team against the state up north. Take a look at Thompson's head as well, when the students rub like a magic lamp to bring them fortune on finals week. Perhaps the most essential part of a student's curriculum is learning the rituals of the Ohio State football game. Every year, students take off their shirts and paint giant O's on them to emphasize their school pride, along with learning several ditties and chants. No. Yes, I do. I participate in the football. I've never really participated in any of the traditions yet, so I don't have a memory of that. Mayor Lake. Though the origins of the Mayor Lake jump are unknown, some believe that it all started back in the 1920s, where freshman students were forced to wear certain white hats that allowed other students to acknowledge that they were underclassmen. If the freshmen removed these white hats, they were thrown right into Mayor Lake. Today, the general belief is that the jump channels the spirit of Woody Hayes to aid in the defeat of Michigan State. Do you believe these traditions have significance behind them, or do you think they are just things that students do in order to fit in at Ohio State? I think they're more traditions because you can be an individual and not have to conform and just have fun and just do it for yourself. Mira Lake, I don't think so because, like, you really, I mean, if you don't, if you don't want to, you don't have to. I mean, I just think everyone should experience Mira Lake just because of how fun it is. And like such, because it's such a huge tradition here, I think that everyone should experience it just for the experience. I don't even jump in Mirror Lake. I don't believe in that black magic hocus pocus mumbo jumbo gobbledygook. How do I state traditions? Man, fuck them. I don't like Ohio State traditions, I just think they're just really annoying. The statue is at the front entrance of the Thompson Library, and is thought to bring good luck upon the students who rub his head when entering. I don't do the rubbing of the head, because I, I, just, I just guess I never like remember to do it. Do you think our traditions have significance such as rubbing Thompson's head for good luck? I suppose no matter that you would say that whether or not it gave you good luck, I wouldn't believe that, but significant. I think that people like to kind of have their own little special thing they can all be a part of. And if it makes people feel better, I really don't care. I don't do it particularly because I don't think it gives me good luck. And by the time I get through the doors, he's already too far away. What do you think of OSU traditions? Hmm. They're for tricks, beaches, and freshmen. Do I look like any of those to you? No, I don't. Because... I live life my own way. So what do you do instead of participating in school traditions? Well, I mostly just like chill. Are you going to go to any of the football games while you attend Ohio State? Yes, I plan to. Last but not least, there are the Ohio State football traditions. At the beginning of every game, the best damn band in the land is led by their drum major, weaving in and out of one another to spell out Ohio. Next, no one can forget the famous mascot, Brutus. It is he, like any other mascot, who starts chants and cheers to boost crowd morale. When victory falls upon the Buckeyes, the audience erupts in song, causing their voices to resonate through all of Northern Columbus, their anthem being Ohio State's alma mater, Carmen, Ohio. I'll be like walking down the street on a Friday night with my friends. And then I'll pass some bro with a backwards visor, popped collar, case of natty, I don't know, some stupid face, and maybe some red cups, who knows. But he'll pass me and he'll be like, oh H. And then I'm just thinking like, fuck you. Some show a genuine interest in the traditions of Ohio State. Others deem it trivial and pointless. But one thing's for certain. With the current trend of enthusiasm and school spirit, the traditions are destined to carry on for generations to come. I always do the OHIO wherever I go with my friends. <laughs>